And it seems like you like cold winters. I like the Nordic uh, frosty landscape and nature cooling off. Yeah, so you know, right now we are in Tönsberg. I've been around for some time. Um, but we can see that things are getting a little bit kind of grey and dull and slow life, like, like Norwegians aren't slow enough as they are. It's really getting even slower fall time. So, yeah. So that's why we kind of continue, continue to explore and evaluate where we would feel the best energy to stay. Yep. Um, yeah, so we're also kind of contemplating where would the best place to be for a few months because we certainly notice the, um, the changes happening with people around us, you know, different people around the planet. And we, well, many of those people are very tuned to the changes um, on the planet. So and we notice that uh, there's a huge shift in people's lives with related to work and relationships and um, down to the core of belief systems. So, and that's, you know, that's part of the big upgrade on the planet that some of you know, um, but we have to relate to our personal lives and we want to make sure that we um, take care of our, ourselves in the best way by spending time with the right people and, and at the right places. Um, to have a smooth daily life journey through these changes. I do not feel I have been productive at all lately with uh, my channel, my videos. I have a lot of stuff recorded. Um, I have a lot of videos unedited. And um, it's been really hard to focus. I mean, I'm not exactly out of work, so it's not about that. I do give most of my time to um, my clients when it comes to my web design business. Um, I have to do that. But my mind is also on uh, providing information. And it's, it, it's, it's information that helps you navigate life and make better choices to unfuck yourself and start to create some magic so you can actually live a life with much greater purpose and with much, with much greater freedom than what you have had. And I bet you have some dreams. And... Uh, you know, many people watching my channel, they have wishes for a better life, a different life at least. They have dreams and, um, you know, they feel stuck in the normalities of life. You know, what we are told, you know, at, in school or by our, par our parents and um, by the news, especially by the government. Whatever, you know how it is. I guess you have, I guess you understand what I'm talking about here. You have a certain level of awareness of, of the, maybe the great awakening that's happening on the planet. I need to get back on track with my, with my message to the world and focus more on helping people that feel stuck, those that are confused about the reality and, and the planet and really boost people's awareness and confidence so they can take back their energy and their freedom and um, create a great life without standing nicely in line or follow the flock because that's going to really hurt the coming months. I wanted to um, get back on the topic of 
choosing your reality because it's going to be damn important now to make a choice of what you believe in. What type of reality do you want to see? What type of reality do you want to manifest? And um, what choices are you going to make so that you can raise your awareness and have more control? Because the more you're aware you are about what's going on and how you function and work on this planet, the more, way more control will be at your disposal to create the life you want. And with greater awareness, you're going to reduce fear, you're going to gain control, and you're going to, you're going to feel more balanced and healthy because you're not so easily tricked anymore. So awareness is the key to everything. There will be a few months. We are now in October 24. I'm seeing a wave of changes happening in a greater scale, but in a kind of a grander scale more often, more rapidly, and it's influencing a lot of a lot of people. Holy fuck, it's stupid driving in Norway. So we are in a time where it is going to be very important for you to choose your reality. Uh, the topic of, you know, creating your life and changing realities and take control of your shit whatever that may be control of your manifestations and your decisions so life can become great it is important that you choose the outcome and the reality you want to experience and that you want to see um, but we are coming in a time now where I intuitively sense and feel because i focus on these things of course i'm aware of the shifting energies of the planet and in people around me because we talk to we talk to a lot of people we meet people we meet a lot of people randomly that seems to be very inspired by our lifestyle and um we have some really weird synchronicities with people that seems to be in the need of hearing what we have to say so that they can make some new decisions in life and maybe uh, you are one of those who have no clue at all so I don't know why you are watching this video and this channel now maybe you're just one of those that are damn curious about what I'm up to and all you know in the past there's family members there's friends from my hometown that's just damn curious about what the hell I'm up to now people that used to laugh at me before with my um, you know, topics, the information I shared, how I live my lifestyle. Uh, you know, the people that are still stuck in the same damn city and playing the same damn song. They sometimes still hang around and take a look at what I'm up to. And some of them, a few of them, um, are starting to you know, open their ears and their minds. So that's interesting. I don't care what you are up to. But I do care that uh, the majority of the planet wakes up wakes the fuck up to what's actually going on because there are huge shifts happening so as some of you know um, you know we have this we have a prophecy you could say there are prophecies on all kinds of well you know topics and levels but the, the grand prophecy for the planet is that we are going through a, a great shift on the planet this has been prophesized by many different cultures and you know from from um, ancient time ancient lost knowledge says that this planet will be going through a great awakening there will be great changes and great shifts on the planet things will the old will break down and the new will come up and this is what's going on now and with that comes a great new understanding of what is actually true so you know for example politics fake governments all of that is breaking down. All that shit with coming from religion is falling apart, uh, which is great. Um, religious people are, you know, they, yeah, some of them will suffer and struggle because it's just fucking with their minds. Now that uh, more and more truths are coming out, they start to see that what they have been 
told and presented and instilled as a religious or spiritual blueprint in their minds is not actually true. It's old mindfuck that religion has presented limited belief systems, you know, that, that religion have programmed into humanity for, for decades. That you know, yeah, and, and they and they will just hold on to this. So and that's gonna that's gonna create a lot of friction for them. But you know, that's that's fine because you know they have free will, they have a choice, they can choose to believe whatever they want. But it's it is beyond the time what is really going to hurt to be, to believe in stupid shit. And uh, you know, I'm not just ditching religion. Uh, I just find it the level of stupidity on the planet is is incredibly high. But it it's starting to change now. This is part of the prophecy. So, like I said, some of the some of the things that people have believed in is going to stick for some time longer. Some people just never want to change. But they will struggle and that's okay that's allowed but there will be a greater majority of humanity that will start to understand what's actually going on on the planet um, when it comes to politics you know when it comes to the most important things that affect humanity's choices and thinking so politics spirituality extraterrestrial life other life forms those are the things, the major things, you know, that's going to uh, affect people's lives. One thing that's going to be very important for you is to, uh, what I call, filter your reality. Uh, you can check this out from my website. I have a, a free guide there to help people change realities. And you do that by choosing to focus on and spending time uh, with different types of people at different places. You know, a new environment, crappy people, crappy places, shitty food, and toxic information like news and TV, uh, news and t uh, you know television and entertainment, and really only start to feed your body and mind with high level, high vibe energy uh, when it comes to food and information and people, and that's going to start you know the biggest change in your life, and it's going to be super important now. You don't want to hang out with just anybody. And um, that's kind of the life we live too. Uh, when we travel around, we have a very small group of like-minded that we allow into our inner circle. We have a greater circle around the planet, of course, but we're not spending really much time with people uh, socially because um, I'm not interested. I don't have time. I have things to focus on. And um, there are very few people I really are interested in spending time with and really not that interested. They want to spend time with me, of course, and I think some of you listening to this now, you understand what I'm talking about. If you are one of the few, um, well, there's more and more now, but one of the awakened ones that have good energy and share knowledge and are motivating and interesting, people want to be around you because you have that energy. And the same thing with me. That's the feedback we get. My girlfriend and I, when we travel around, how kind of inspiring we are, how interesting we are, how exciting we are, and people want to spend time with us because they don't have anybody else like us in their, you know, group of friends and, and social network. And that is a very common thing. But, you know, we don't want that. And I know some other people around me, they have the same thing. You know, you want like-minded people, people who think greater and bigger and and um, have a conscious mind so they make healthy choices in life and most people in society they don't do that and then you don't want to have you don't want to spend time with that you know people have to first elevate their own levels so that they kind of resonate with you that's important and some people believe that this is a cold thing no this is not a cold thing this is a fucking self-protection mechanism I want to spend time with good energy. I don't want to have everybody on my lap just because they enjoy it. Um, and that's how you should be too. Spend time with healthy, bright minds who think for themselves, step out of the norms, um, expand you know, their minds and really want to understand life and reality.
and uh, with the time we are coming into now with big things coming out truths coming out it's going to rock the world for a lot of people and you want to make sure that you are among the awakened ones if you are looking to experience a new and improved yourself a new and improved your, you I hope you take these things to heart because it's gonna help you it's gonna create a shift because when you make these new choices um, your energy changes your frequency range changes literally which will reflect a new reality trust that process and give it time and you will see things start to change I don't know what your goals are but it would be super cool if you would share them or at least your dreams that you have in the comments for this video uh, I will reply and um, stay with the like-minded people because that will raise you up to a new level where dreams happen don't repeat the same damn song over and over um, that's not creating a life uh, some of you know have seen uh, maybe uh, is that I haven't uh, posted on Instagram for for many months I got just damn tired of the whole social fuckery thing and uh, how fake much of that is and how hard it is to grow my my account actually I want to gauge people that are motivated to take control of this reality of the personal reality because the more people who do that and start activating their brains and think for themselves it's going to shift the whole damn planet that's some of the things you got to understand with this the bigger of a crowd that starts to wake up from this sleep and dream called life uh, the bigger the acceleration will be for a change on the planet and if you want to be part of that if you want to be part of that change um, you can you have that choice if you want to be a sleepwalker you can do that too but they are going to operate on a different level where things fall apart which is also allowed you have the choice